Nope. Keep an eye on things, Sam. I'll be real here. All right, playing around with uh, a sidearm balance, a leg bind sidearm balance, transitioning into a flying lizard. <clears throat> Hold on, I gotta check this other camera. Hey, we got enough battery. All right. So think Vashistasana, a side plank with a leg bind around the, the, the support arm. And I'm pretty warm. I've been practicing this morning, but I'm going to do just a couple poses here to put my hips on notice of what I'm asking them to do. How about we go into a Vira Vedrasana? Two, four, you two. Kind of let the hips settle into it. Now I got my right leg forward and my left leg back. And I'm only going to do this on one side today. So when you want to do the left side, just take the cues and flip them around. Breathing, of course. Face is soft. Oh, there we go. Mmm. How about a cheek with an All right, I think we're about there. So let's, uh, oh, let's just open that space, right to your spine. For me, the trickiest thing about this is getting the spine on it. I kind of want to crunch into it once I get airborne. Lengthen the spine. I'm going to exhale down. Like in, in a bent knee triangle, my right hand is on the mat, the inside of my right foot. And I'm jutting my right knee generously forward beyond my arm. I'm going to leave the left hand down to the mat next to the right hand. Do a little swiggling and a little wiggling and brush some hands away. And we want to finagle our right shoulder down and behind the right knee. So whatever kind of wiggles you got to do, just do them mindfully. You know, as always, if any of this stuff hurts, let me back up. Now, once my shoulder is there, I'm going to take my right hand around behind my right heel, plant it on the mat outside of my right foot. Straighten my right arm as I bend my right knee, binding to my upper right arm. Notice my left foot is flat, so I'm going to bring all my weight onto my right hand, just like a side plank, and take left hand to the sky. Go flying lizard, I'll bring left hand back down. Come up on left toes, bend elbows, they go into chaturanga, shoulders come forward, and just lift up. Take a foot down, take a breath as you swing right leg around. Oh, a down dog seems appropriate right about now, wouldn't you think? Hello, spider. Mm. So simple, not easy, but simple. Yeah. You know, we're not doing any kind of Cirque du Soleil stuff. It's just simple, fundamental things. You know, a lunge into a side plank. And we just wrap a little leg around the arm and balance up on the arm. And it's, 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 then you're ready. You're there. The leg is bound around upper arm. So it's just a matter of returning to a planking position, bending elbows, and then the shoulders got to come forward. You want to center of gravity forward to find the balance point. And then the back leg can just engage some, some sweetness along the back side of your body. Core and then leg lifts. Set it down and then inhale. Unbind the front leg, sweep it around and catch you a down dog or a plank and we vinyasa catch the other side. So you know that. Hit me up with any questions. You'll find this video on uh, YouTube and Instagram. I guess that's where things are happening these days. I don't know. I'm an old guy that just does this stuff, right? Y'all give me some uh, information when you try it out, when you play with it. Let me know your thoughts on it, okay? 
This is just something I picked up from uh, a guy named Brian Cassidy. He kind of added some other things into it, but uh, <laughs> oh, hey, there's people watching. Anyhow, uh, I'll catch y'all again sometime. All right, thanks. I think. <laughs> Oh, I gotta stop that one. Oops.